everybody this is Lisa welcome back to my channel if you're a new subscriber welcome okay you guys I'm here with a quick little project share and as you can see these are the suitcases that a whole lot of people's been making so I wanted to try it out and if you have not made one of these and you've been seeing the videos you definitely have got to try it it's really super easy to create it really is um it's not hard at all this these two i haven't really embellished them too much on the outside i did get stuck on that part but this one was the first one that i made and i just got it stuck with some velcro dots and these are just some little flowers that i made to put on the top and when you open it up i haven't did anything to the inside yet um so this like i said this was the first one that i've made and i don't know how well you can see but right here on the top of these lines is another little lip that i created to go on the inside and i did that all the way on three sides on the bottom and that is to put when you close it you, the box is just not together it's it doesn't it's not wobble it doesn't wobble it keeps it intact but I think I should have made it a little bit bigger now this is like up about a quarter of an inch and I should have did maybe a half an inch but this is the first one that I made it still came out really cute I am gonna um, finish it up with some something on the inside I'm not sure now this is the second one that I made and this is made with um, it was a hot buy paper at Michaels and it's mermaid but it's the colors are really um, like peach pink and like a gray and tan really pretty paper pad and um, like I said, I haven't embellished the outside at all, but this one, I made the handle a little bit lower and a little bit thinner, and it is a smaller box, and when you open it up, see, I made this lip just a little bit taller, so that's about a half an inch, and I think that works better with the closure. Now, this idea right here, you know, the suitcases, you have the little pocket in the back, but I... Um, lifted this idea from Tamika y'all all know her she scrapped the world so I seen the suitcase that she made and she did hers like this I really love that and what I did is by me putting this little half an inch right here when I put this in there I had to put it towards you know towards the back so this could still close but it works out good because I made it longer so it can come out you know and everything still stays in place okay so back here i got a few little goodies of course bows we all have to have bows and right here is just some chipboard pieces that came from michael's last year in a pack and i there's some unicorns in there stars and i think some rainbows but gold and white it really matches the paper and then i just made this flower here with this hobby lobby trim and this trim right here came from michael's last year it went on clearance um i don't know what kind of trim you would call that but it's the loops so i just made that little flower because i had some of the peach uh ruffle trim in my stash so i used some of it just to keep the color going and you guys i put a traveler's notebook in the suitcase it held it perfect and I did make this one right here to fit a passport size so that was I knew that was gonna be what I was gonna put in the bottom so I made this traveler's notebook right here it's got gold elastic one inch spine and I love that wood grain paper there 
and I just put a cut apart there it says relax and here is just a tag that I made that's the bag really really pretty love that ocean scene and um, that just tucks there in that little tuck spot and then there's your first insert and I've got pockets on both sides of the insert this is a laminated dashboard here is a folder there's a few cut aparts from the pad in there this is the second insert and there's also pockets on the front and the back of that cover back of the dashboard last insert pockets on the front and the back and then this is your page marker and it is a pocket there and I just haven't put a pin yet but the pin is going to fit perfect right here and it is still going to fit perfect in here and then here I just um, uh, layered the bottom piece with that paper there and that right there is the second suitcase that I made um, I'm not sure if I'm going to embellish the outside I don't know what y'all tell me what do y'all think I should embellish it with um, just like a cluster of flowers or what I just it's it's mermaid themed so I don't know and I don't really have any shells um, but that would be cute like some shells with some netting um, but I, just, I don't have any of those but anyway, what would y'all do with it? Y'all let me know. What would y'all do? How would y'all embellish both of these? And that is just my little quick little project share. I thank you all for watching. And you all have a great weekend. It's Friday. And yes, I plan on doing some crafting. And um, that's it. And I have a new swap. I haven't got that video. I haven't released that video. So um, that's just a little hint for ever who's watch the whole video i'll probably put it up in the morning um y'all have a great great weekend thanks for watching